Hey there awesome people, how are you guys doing? So this is your V bro from Tech Week and so today in this video I am going to be discussing about the best PDF editor for Windows. But before starting the video I would like to share that only 1.4% of you guys are subscribed to my channel so please do subscribe to my channel as it means the world to me. So the application that we're going to be talking about in this video is the Isas PDF editor. Well, some of the key features that the Isas PDF editor has is that it can convert PDF files to Excel, Word, PowerPoint, images, or vice versa. You can also edit OCR, merge, split, compress, add sign, and do a lot more. Now to download this PDF editor, go to the description and there you can find all the download links. Now let's open up Ezaz PDF editor on my computer and let's take a look at all the features in action. Now as you open up Ezaz PDF editor, you'll be greeted with this screen. Here you can check out the recently opened files as well as there are quick options like edit PDFs, create PDFs and combine PDFs. Now for this video, I'll be opening up this PDF file and show you all the features that you'll get in Isa's PDF editor. This PDF is only used for demonstration purpose only and has not been tampered or used for commercial purpose or any sort of like that. Alright, so as you can see here, we have opened up our PDF and if we go to our left hand side of the window, here you can find the three toggles that are basically pages, bookmark, and search well basically pages shows the number of pages that you have inside your pdf and same goes to the bookmark it shows the number of bookmarks you have and the search text is used to search a specific sentence or a word inside your pdf file now going to the top we have the create button here you can create a blank document or create from an existing file this is great if you want to add or merge two or more number of document PDFs into one. This feature is pretty great for students as they have to combine or merge important notes or information into one. Beside create, we have the convert option. Here you can convert your PDF file into various formats. Mainly you can convert your PDF file into Word, Excel, PowerPoint, HTML, Bitmap, JPEG, PNG, GIF and TIFF. These are the major formats that are used all around the world and Isa's PDF editor supports these formats. The next feature we have is edit. This feature will enable you to edit your PDF files and basically you can edit text, images as well as you can add your own text or images as you can see on the right hand side of the window. You can also change the fonts size of the fonts and other stuffs related to it and also you can add url links into your pdfs as well which is pretty great if you want to share something really important next we have ocr well ocr stand for optical character recognition and this ocr technology enables you to convert different types of documents such as scanned paper documents, PDF files, or images captured by a digital camera or your smartphone into editable and searchable data. This is a very important tool because nowadays we do scan many things or like documents with our smartphone these days and then convert them into PDF files. Now you can use Isa's PDF editor to edit these optically scanned PDF files which is pretty useful. The next feature we have is pages. In pages option, you can see that on the right hand side, you can find the features like insert from file, insert blank page, delete, extract, replace, split document, crop, rotate, and combine PDFs. And if you go more down, you can find options for header and footer, background, watermark, and Bates numbering. Well, these are the options that you can get under pages. The next feature is nothing but protection. Here you can actually protect your PDF file by encrypting it with the password. There is also a feature of selecting the encryption algorithm which is pretty amazing. So if you are working on a really sensitive project, you can use Isa's PDF editor to protect your PDF with various degree of protection. Alright, so the next feature that we have is sign. 
Here you can use it to sign your documents or sign field. You can also certify inside the sign feature as you can see right here. Now next to sign, we have comment option. Here you can add your own comment on any section of the PDF file. And there is also the drawing marker feature that you can use to draw something inside your PDF file. The last option in the list is forms. In this feature, you can add various elements like push button, checkbox, radio button, and many more. This is really important tool if you have to create a form for any kind of project or stuff like that. Going for the right side, we can see that the undo and redo buttons along with the save icon. You can also save your file by pressing Ctrl plus S button as you do it for other software. You can do it right here as well. The last and my personal favorite feature in Eza's PDF editor is Compress, which you can find it on the topmost portion of the window as you can see it right here. Inside Compress option, you get reduced file size and optimized current document. So you can reduce the size of the document in which you're working on. I use this feature a lot in my work because I don't like sending very big sized PDFs. Instead, I compress it using the EZUS PDF editor and then share it with my friends or other official works. Well, these are all the features that makes this the best PDF editor on the market right now. Go to the description down below to download this great software. But I would like to suggest that before buying the full product, please go ahead and try the trial version and then go to buy the full version. I personally use this software and I pretty much love and that's why it is just the best edit PDF editing software available. I would also like to thank Ezus for sponsoring this video. And that's all for this video guys. If you really love this video, please do consider subscribing to my channel. As you already know, only 1.4 percentage of you guys are subscribed to my channel. Well, that's pretty much it guys. Have a great day. God bless you all. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.